Spade, bear wire, or banana plugs? That's the question. Okay, this comes from Art in Springfield, Missouri. Missouri, yeah. Hey Paul, I'm really excited about, and uh, no, I'm sorry, I'm really enjoying my BHK preamp and BHK power amp. Yes, good job. Those are some of the best amps in the world at any price. Take it from me. I love those amps. Wish I could say I designed them, but I didn't. Anyway, they exceed my expectations every time I listen to records. Good. I am curious about the difference, if any, between connecting speaker cables with bare wires, spades, or banana plugs. What do you suggest and why? Well, the best connection you're going to make on a speaker is bare wire. So if I can take the copper and put it right into the binding post and grind that sucker down, then I don't have any of the potential impurities of a connector to go through. I would rather have it as pure as possible. So that would always be my first choice. That said, there's a problem with that. Any speaker cable worth its salt, and that's a kind of a funny term, isn't it? Worth its salt. Do you know where that comes from? Salt used to be one of the most precious commodities on earth. I mean, we're talking long ago, you know, when they're building the pyramids kind of stuff. Long ago, salt was, was probably, I mean, it was reserved for just, you know, it was rationed out. And if you're working out in the desert and you're hot, uh, you need salt. If, and, and, and I don't know if that's specifically where it came from, but I do know that people needed salt to survive, especially when they were getting dehydrated and all that. So if you weren't worth your ration of salt for the day, you didn't get it. You just <coughs> went out and died. So anyway, speaker cables worth their salt <laughs> are going to be from companies like AudioQuest and Kimber, and, you know, those kind of companies. And those cables are going to be terminated. I don't know. I suppose they do sell bare wire, but I, I rarely ever see it. And chances are, whatever you have is probably going to be terminated. And, 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 and I assume if you have BHK style equipment, it goes without saying you're not using frickin' lamp cord. You didn't go down to Home Depot and, and buy a, a roll of zip cord <laughs> and hook it up. So I assume you have decent cables. And so then my recommendation is spade connectors. Now, I personally use bananas, and I do that just because I'm lazy. I connect and disconnect those amplifiers in Music Room 1 all the time. Go away. Go away. Flies. I have to. I mean, we do a lot of auditioning and changing, and that's just part of the, part of the job here. But you don't have that problem. You're going to connect that sucker up and just enjoy it. So use spade connectors. It's the next best thing to bare wire. You can put that spade connector on, crank down the, the BHK connector, which we, we custom designed that so that you could put a wrench on it and, and just you know, nail that sucker down and, and you'll, be, uh, you'll be doing real well. So in the end, practical application use spades. Okay, great question. Thank you for asking it. I will talk to you tomorrow.